Sodden earth of home counties now sweltering neath the rhinoceros's horn. Pummeled by powder, these gods knew of great times still echoing in the lost lands and simple peoples. Or so it seemed when we set sail. After the barracks were built, a trench system was designed and further forts were built along the lines of greatest interest to the enemy. Gun positions were introduced with the invention of the Magnus device. Prior to this vehicle of terror being created, Littles could stop an invasion. We defied them. Our great land and blighty will always be ours. Forever England, just one corner of this field where the earth holds. Ginnery and gunnery, the free strode out amongst the fold and so did slew. Dragons a boot, here Harold knew. Angels sang and cupids of bowls of orange fruits, kumquats, leches, and balbatacutes. Great feathered birds bathed in soft pools of yellow gold. Lag, lagoons, or Turkish riches awaited them there. The only shadows were in our minds. This is where the demons did their bidding. Manifesto, for all the intents and purposes, a declaration, a decree. Here at dusk, the three of us that by name are the Knights of the Wet Chair. This being WSSK, for journals of design and communication, for the posting of bills, for digestion of intellectual property. Cool is the highest possible accolade, the best a thing can be, but cool also means disinterested, aloof and poo. Let's start again. Cool also means disenfranchised, dispassionated, alienated and frightened. Cool is non-committal for fear that to commit to an unpopular idea might make one uncool. Cool defined is cool dissipated. Cool cannot know the light lest it wither. Cool is uncreative. Reasons why we kill cool. Cool. Secondary chapter at Our lives. Our lives begin to end the day we become silent about the things we believe. Cool, if the term can still be used, is being true to thine own self.